Right, come on, man, I'm back. What are you telling me, people? Spiritual deals, lit, consistent, best content, content creator on this platform in London. Who's doing better than me in London? You know what I mean? I just got that personality that not a lot of these guys have. You know what I mean? I'm just got that drive. I'm always out here, still doing my thing. You know what I mean? Telling you, no one could put me through anything out here to make me sad and depressed because, man, what I realised... Why are you going to let other people disturb your emotions and disturb you of how you feel? You know what I mean? They ain't putting money in your pocket. They ain't doing nothing for you. You know what I mean? Once you realise that most people can't, like, ain't doing nothing really for you, so, like, why are you going to let them affect you like that? You know what I mean? I'm telling you, start using your mind, man. Don't let people call your phone on all of this rubbish. What you do, you press that red light. End that shit, bro. You know what I mean? I'm telling you. The more negativity you allow in your life, the more it just con could continue, I'm telling you. It's going to hold your blessings back, hold you back. And yeah. Man, you're, I, you're the only one that can change your life, I'm telling you. No one else can change your life. You. But yeah. you got to understand. I be scrolling on Insta and just, you know what I mean, just going on YouTube sometime and here and then. And just looking at guys with these females. Like, when I need females, I mean these... High price 40s, you know what I mean? All the guys know all the high price 40s out here. I don't need to name them again. The name them in previous videos. You know what I mean? But this one in particular came up in, in my Insta feed. It, what is it? Um, Bo, that girl that, uh, that Digger D was with is with another guy. I'm telling you, she's jumping. She's jumped. She, she's jumped onto another guy now. I don't know what this guy, I don't know who this guy is, but she's with him now. Yeah, you know I mean, I'm telling you, don't hook up with these. It's a violation to hook up with these sort of Insta 40s, these high priced ones. You know what I mean? That go around to drill rappers. I'm telling you, any female that's dealt with a drill rapper, just exit, <laughs> exit them out your rotation or your life or whatever, bro, because they're just, they're for the streets, bro. They're for them, they're on the market. You know what I mean? I'm telling you, these females. Yeah, you know I mean Tennessee Fresh, My Mills, all these other. Yeah, you know I mean Kenza O Nine. They're all they're all on the market for sale, bro. This is why I say, don't take them so seriously. Like they can be your wife, they can be this that because man, they are for the whole world. I'm telling you, these females are for the whole world, bro. You that's what you got to understand. Once you get in the realization of that, you won't take them as seriously. Yeah, you know I mean. You got Tennessee Fresh doing a threesome with Digger D. After you even knowing that, why would you even want to even put that girl in your in your vicinity and in, in your your life and put the, put her all on your socials and shit like this? Because I just I just see some bullshit. What, bro? I'll show you some cringy shit. It's like I don't know. The caption of the video is like, what did it say? Like, um. This guy is official with Tennessee Fresh or something. It's some cringy shit. Like, why would you want to be official with a a, a forty box? Like, man, yeah, she might have all these likes, followers, and all this like clout, but it's like she's a fuck nigga. I'm telling you, don't be putting thoughts um just above you. You know what I mean? Like, they ain't. Not even a bubble. Don't don't put them in your like your life like that. Because they'll just you might think they're adding value, but they're devaluing you. If if you know, you already just do your research on them online, type their name on, on the internet, they'll come with a whole heap of bullshit, but I'm telling you. But all in all, stay away from girls that deal with drill rappers, I'm telling you. <laughs> Girls that do with Joe rappers, they, they have weird energy, but I'm telling you. You know what I mean? They're dealing with guys that are just talking about all this rubbish on their tracks and then you're dealing with energy of them. Bro, understand their thoughts and they're for the streets, bro. They're like, I'm telling you, they're high priced 40s, bro. Go around to the highest bidder, yeah. 100k for that house. It's just like the female, whoever has the most money or whatever money whatever materialistic shit she's hopping on that dick bro she that guy's offering her 50k not even 50k a holiday and yeah you know i mean a, a restaurant and money and shit like this she go over she going over there bro 
I'm telling you, man, you gotta understand. Leave these females to their own devices, I'm telling you. Because you might think oh, you're posting her on your Insta, as I said, being, yeah, you know I mean, posting her on all this and it's going to give you some sort of validation and clout. Yeah, it might give you clout, but not even clout, but like, it might give you some sort of validation. But people know what these females already like. It's like, they're already all about the internet. Like, if I type in her name right now, it's over. Like, I could have seen all bunch of videos, you know what I mean, threesome, fucking, um, with this other guy, this, this guy. Yeah, you know I mean, going out here doing the most, but it's up to you, like who. I don't know. It's up to you in the end. Yeah, you know I mean, but see, if that if I was in their position, you ain't being posted on the camera and shit like this, knowing that you will fuck. Because not all Insta girls are fucks, but I'm telling you, I seen some nice Insta baddies that I like, bro. But see. They ain't on like the 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 forty side like that, bro. You know what I mean? They're like on the side. They're on the side of like just being them. You know what I mean? They ain't going around trying to uh, leech resources off this guy and that guy and this guy and doing a whole heap of fuckery and this guy and then hopping in a relationship with you. I'm telling you, man. That's what they want. They want to hop in a relationship with a sucker so they can use him for. His, his P, his resources and, yeah, you know I mean, I'm telling you, you got to think wiser out here. You can't settle down with no Insta for, I'm telling you, even, what's it, dig a child, hook up with these, you know what I mean, get in a relationship with these women, doing the most, buying them barking bags and all this bullshit. Man, if you have money and shit, don't deal with these women, you know what I mean? Go find some, go find a, a girl out here in reality that that will appreciate what you give her because these women wouldn't appreciate what you do for them. Reason being because they have so, like, yeah, I mean, they have so much other resources that they can take from. I'm telling you, they have other kingdom, kingdoms that they can enter and just take shit from. I'm telling you, these sorts of women are no one to be dealing with long term relationship, bond, nothing like this, bro. This is why I say it's a violation, you know what I mean? That Danny guy feels like he's on top because he's smashing that shit, putting, you know what I mean? Putting her all over. I don't know, bro. Just doing whatever, but man, understand. They're fucked, nigga. You ain't getting no. You, you can get some sort of like validation for, yeah, you're, you're active, bro. You know what I mean? You, you got it takes some sort of game or whatever to get the women in the first place, but more time, these guys don't even have game, bro. It's just like. They just, they just, they have money. They have money. That's that's the only reason why they're getting what they they're getting. If they didn't have this money, they would be they wouldn't be getting what they're getting. They don't care about them. I'm telling you, brother. This is why I say money can get you anything you want out here. But it's like, why would you want females for your money anyway? It's just like, it's like it's prostitution. It's like they don't really like you for you. They like you for what you're giving them. That's. That's what you gotta understand. That they like you, they like you before for what you're giving them. So yeah, understand, bro. Don't be feeling like you're doing something. I'm telling you, take the money out of the equation, take your resources out of the equation. She ain't fucking with you, nigga. I'm telling you, when a female actually fucks you for you and just the way you are, personality-wise, whatever, whatever you are, bro, it's so much more genuine. You know what I mean? Like, you can feel the energy between you and her. That's, that's the feeling you want to be getting because that's what I be getting when I message what, I, what females I like. You know what I mean? I be getting that nice feeling like, oh, you know what I mean? That's what you want. You don't want that no feeling that this, just that feeling of this giving. You know what I mean? That's because that's what these guys be feeling. They're just like, oh, I've got to give. It's like, they're, they're, they're tr it's transaction. It's like a transactional your relationship, it's like, if she ain't getting what she wants out of it, she's gone, nigga, I'm telling you. Man, this is why I say you just have to just smash these chicks and just move along, bro. Don't take these high-priced, you know what I mean, 100k follow bimbos and, you know what I mean, 1 million and stuff like that. It's serious, bro, because 
they don't even take themselves seriously, bro. This why, <laughs> this why I say, bro. You, I mean, you got all this move on me a day and this. Do what you're doing, you know what I mean? Because. You, you don't want to keep these females around your, your life like that, you know what I mean? Because you're going to see her, as soon as she jumps out of a relationship with this guy, she's going to jump in another relationship with another celebrity, another big guy that has a, a lot of PA, P, another footballer, another jewel rapper, another rapper. I'm telling you, these females, they ain't loyal to no one, bro, you know what I mean? <laughs> they ain't loyal to no one, so why the fuck are you going to be loyal to them? Man, they're just in it for themselves, you know what I mean? They're laying down in the bed, you taking all these cringy pictures and shit. Man, you a lame nigga, I'm telling you. Guys, guys that do this with these females, they're lame, bro. You know what I mean? Because everyone knows what she's like deep down. I know, you know, so do the audience know. You know what I mean? Man. This laugh, bro. This laugh. This laugh. This laugh. Because these guys are probably laughing at us like, oh yeah, I got this girl. She's so nice. Blah blah blah. But man, just type their name in online. I'm telling you, look if I type her name in now. Bro, like. Like look, look at this, this I'm looking at all the shit that that is this about this girl. Yeah you know I mean about not even about this girl, this it, insta girls in general. Just type their name in on YouTube, Google, all the bullshit will come up come up, I'm telling you. Man, guys be taking fuck seriously. Thinking that they're winning when everyone's winning. You ain't the only one winning, brother. I could be winning, I'm telling you. <laughs> Literally, man. I'm telling you, you gotta you gotta have some self-respect, but I'm telling you, have self-respect, you know what I mean? That girl really got in a threesome with Ebony Baxter fucking doing some bullshit with Digger D. And you doing and you really there taking some lovey dovey pictures like she's a virgin or some bullshit, yeah you know I mean god damn man I'm telling you man a lot of guys who just embarrass themselves without even knowing they're just embarrassing themselves yeah she might look nice pretty she's got a nice body but her track record is not good I'm telling you you gotta know a female's track record see I like to do my research on females and just know what they're about a little bit and just see what they're like what kind of females not even like what you know, like what their track record i'm telling you got to look at these females track records so you can take them a little more seriously like if you just look at this shit that they go through and whatever why the fuck are you gonna take them so seriously for you know what i mean I'm telling you guys just accept anything because it's like they don't get what they want usually so it's like whatever comes their way they just grab it you know what i mean man I don't know. It's you. Let these guys keep doing what they're doing. Getting their money rinsed. Getting their... Yeah, you know I mean? Getting their clout taken off them. Because that's what these females are doing. They're just taking clout off these guys, bro. You know what I mean? All this clout. Taking that shit. Because I'm telling you, like... Don't you realise? These these girls, they hook up with all these big... Either YouTubers, big rappers, whatever. Because they can gain shit off them. Resources popularity i'm telling you they they they're in it for something they just dared to be laying down with you just to lay down with you because they like you fuck all that shit bro they don't like you for you nigga but yeah bro <laughs> telling you man get you a girl out here that actually does like you for you man i'm telling you that's why i say leave like unless like with these insta girls, you gotta be kind of be careful, as I said, like, because more time they ain't gonna be as genuine as girls that you find out on the reality, you know what I mean? But if you do come across insta girl that you like, do you know what you do? 
Because I've came across Insta girls that I like, but it's like they in that category. Like if I type in their name, they ain't gonna come with some bullshit, bro. Like, yeah, you know I mean, like doing some crazy things or this. You know what I mean? Because I don't know, it's like guys, it's like females have been passed around. It's just like, who is it? Fredo and Maya Mills and someone Maya Mills with Digger or something. I, let me tell you, I, I'm sure it's something like that, bro. Like they were fighting over some girl. Uh, hold on. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, bro, like, just some madness, bro, I'm telling you, like, look, this typing shit online, bro, you gotta understand. So you gotta do your research, you guys don't do that research before they deal with women, it's like, what's wrong with you? Well, oh, goddamn, man. I don't know, guys just don't think like me. I see, I think strategic, I think deep. I go deeper into shit. Guys just think surface level, the looks, and that's it. What her body. But you're not looking into the system, bro. See, I look into the system, into the hardware. But I got that, man. Think more wise out here. Don't get rinsed. It's not worth it. I'm telling you, it's not worth it spending five grand ten grand whatever you're doing holidays on these bimbos because man she's gonna jump on she's gonna be on another video of another flipping yeah you know i mean guy here that's yeah you know i mean doing whatever they're doing and you're gonna be looking at them like oh shit like i thought i thought she liked me she didn't fucking like you nigga she's just stealing your resources i'm telling you man it's all about survival here don't let people steal from your kingdom and this yeah you know i mean Guys, just let females is still from the kingdom, and that would be the end of it. See, you got to think more strategic like that. You can't be letting females come in with their swift ideas and execute them and just leave you high and dry. Yeah, you got the SEX, but you really just it's like prostitution because you paid all that money, you ain't getting that shit for free. Man, genuine attraction goes a long way, and yeah. Because if you keep letting people, females steal, steal your resources, it's going to be a repetitive cycle. It's like, you're, the next female that you like, you're going to come across, you're just going to allow her to steal your resources and then she's going to go to another guy and do the exact same thing, you know what I mean? And you're going to see it and be like, wow, I'm telling you, you need to snap out that mindset of just allowing them to steal your resources and just run away, nigga. But yeah, bro, that's all. Stay tuned and I'm out. Peace. <laughs>